Hi everybody, I have a new book. Um, this one is called Medieval Mischief by Linda Rakos. This one just happens to be a digital download that I printed on cardstock. The cover is in color, but I ran out of a colored ink, so I apologize for that. On the thumbnail, you should see what the cover looks like in color. It's beautiful. Um, this book is really, really cute, especially if you like the medieval um, knights, dragons, all that kind of whimsical stuff. Um, the artist, Linda, she says she's been working on this book for quite some time. And um, you can really tell because the, uh, the quality of her art and the details of the pictures really show up um, in this book. All right, let's start flipping. A lot of these pictures have a lot of story backgrounds and details you can tell. Um, just some of them are just random and whimsical. But I really, really like her style. Lots of princesses and uh, princes and unicorns and everything in here. I love this mermaid. Really, really cute details on the mermaid. All the frogs have different patterns on here. I love how she does her um, her little half uh, star, half sun. Really cute. The castle in the sky. Sorry if you can hear that. It is storming over here. We've got a thunderstorm going on. Little fairies flying around in the woods with the princess. Anybody that follows me knows that I love mushrooms so, and I love her, her little gnomes. Very, very cute page. I love her line work. It's real thick and detailed. It's easy for um, people like me. <laughs> Bad eyesight, we can see it. I like the turtles pulling the little carriage puppy. We've got fairies. A magician, kind of like Merlin. I love the castle. I love this with the dragon and we got the knights down here. This looks like a festival. More of the festival with the little jesters. Here's a bigger jester. The princess in the pea. Adorable. These giant hands coming down. Everyone is asleep. I love the faces of the little um, magicians here. I just all the details that she has with the books and just every little thing on the bookshelf. She just paid a lot of attention to the details of this book. Looks like we have the knight rescuing the maiden. One the dragon. Looks like Rapunzel. Oh, I love this dragon. And I love how she does her little um, bushes. Or trees, I'm not sure, but they look like little bushes. They're very cute. cute. Like the princess and the prince. Really cute. Fairies and everything in the sky. A little town. This is the one I did. I'm very, very proud of it. I love how it came out. Um, the, all the background, the blue is polychromos. The uh, um, trees and the grass are Ohuhu markers. The gold and 
couple other glitter colors I have on here. The silver are these um, flare flare glitter gel pens, and the horse and star uh, are is the jelly roll um, the jelly roll silver pen. I really, really, really like how um, the gradient of the background came out. And oh, let me show you what's good about printing your own um, books on your own cardstock. It can soak through; doesn't matter. Um, this is still frame worthy. You can hang this up. You don't have to worry about anything on the back. You know, you've printed; it, it's yours hang it up and because these are all squared off it's just ready to go this looks like Jack and the Beanstalk this looks like Robin Hood to me I can see faces in the trees I love her leaves and all her little flowers. The details are really, really nice. It's just very different. It's different than any coloring book I've seen. And y'all know I love hand drawn whimsical, so. I like the mermaid triton. This is probably the one I'll color next amazing we got a giant here oh I just noticed it even says giant <laughs> I didn't see that before this looks like the kitchen area they're cooking we got the little cats and the mice outdoor kitchen I should say I love the clouds with the little stars hanging down how cute and the lady she's in the boat I think that's a viola she's playing adorable I would say this book is definitely advanced but there are some pictures that you know beginners could definitely color the king and queen another unicorn with a really pretty um, princess here gorgeous this picture fascinates me it's like um, you can see faces in like, I don't know if these are mountains or caves or what, but the mouths open up. And they got this horse over here with this guy, a little jester guy. And here are those really cool trees that I like. This is a good page. I like it. Got this guy, looks like a griffin over here. This is a nice one too. The last page is really really nice um get the princess and the knight and the castle in the background it's like he saved the day <laughs> okay so i know that she does have an etsy shop um i don't believe she sells the book on her etsy shop i believe it's just single pages on there but i know that these books are available on her amazon page and i will link um, everything down in the description box down there at the bottom for y'all if you're interested um, please give me a, a thumbs up and a subscribe I would really appreciate it thanks for watching if you have any questions please leave them down in the comments and I'll be glad to get back to you thanks a lot bye bye